subscribe to my YouTube channel Passionate Piping Engineer and also press the bell icon to get the latest notification of the upcoming videos. Friends, please subscribe to my channel because subscription is only thing which keeps me motivated to create more such knowledge sharing videos. Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Passionate Piping Engineers. In this video, we will learn about the introduction to flanges means what are flanges, where they are used, why they are used and we will also see the classification of flanges. So let us first see what is a flange. A flange is a disc shaped component used for connecting pipes to valves, piping specialty items such as trainer, instrument items such as level gauges and all types of the equipment or any other integral component within the piping system. It is the most important component in the piping system. Flanges are used as an alternative to welded connection to facilitate years of shipping, erection, maintenance and operations. Because if you weld the pipes directly to the valves or equipments or any other components which require maintenance, then we have to cut the weld and modify it which is not an economical and good practice. Similarly, threaded connections also cannot be preferred over flange connections in large bore pipes because threading a large bore pipe is not an economical or reliable operation. Flanges are usually welded or screwed that is they are socket welded butt welded and threaded or we can say screwed depending upon the size and requirements flange joints are made by bolting together two flanges with a gasket between them to provide a seal for a leak proof joint as shown in the adjacent figure which shows the cross-sectional view of the flange joint assembly with gaskets and stud bolts Dimensional standards for flanges is ASME B16.5 for size from half inch NPS to 24 inch NPS whereas ASME B16.47 for size range from 26 inch NPS to 80 inch NPS and ASME section 8 division 1 and 2 from size 80 inch NPS and above. Now let us see how the dimension of the flanges are given as per ASME B16.5. So flange dimensions or flange nomenclature are as follows. Bore diameter. Bore diameter is equal to the inside diameter of the pipe. It usually depends upon the schedule of the pipe. Welding hub diameter. Welding hub diameter is equal to the outside diameter of the pipe NPS. BCD or PCD. BCD stands for bolt circle diameter and PCD stands for pitch circle diameter. Both are the diameters of the circle which goes through the center of each of the bolt holes. It is one of the critical dimensions of the flange. Flange OD or flange outside diameter. Flange OD is the outside diameter of the flange. Raise face. It is the face of the flange which comes directly in contact with the gasket. Raise face thickness. It is the height of the raise face which is depending upon the pressure rating as specified by ASME B16.5 specification that is for 150 rating and 300 rating it is 1.6 mm or 1 by 16 inch and for 400 rating to 2500 rating it is approximately 6.4 mm or 1 by 4 inch. Flange thickness. It is the thickness of the flange which includes the hub height but it does not include the raise face height. Length through hub. It is the total length of the flange which includes the face height if applicable also includes the hub height with flange thickness. Number of bolt holes. It is the number of bolt holes which a flange has for mating the other components. The bolt holes are in multiple of four. Bolt holes shall be equal spaced or paired of hole space. Bolt holes shall be equal spaced and pairs of bolt holes shall scruddle fitting center lines. Bolt holes diameter. It is the diameter of the bolt holes on a flange through which the bolts are passed and bolted to the mating flange. Now let us see the classification of flanges. Classification of flanges. Flanges are classified based on pipe attachments, based on facing, based on base finish, based on pressure temperature rating, and based on material of construction. On base of pipe attachment flange. On base of pipe attachments means where and how the flange is going to join the pipe. So on the base of pipe attachment flange we have weld neck flange, slip on flange, socket welded flange, threaded flange, lap joint flange, long weld neck flange and blind flange. Based on facing of the flange means how the face of the flange which is going to mate or host the gasket. First one here is a raised face flange, flat face flange, a ring type joint male and female and tongue and groove based on face finish of the flange flange face finish ensures that the flange mates with the gasket and the comparison flange perfectly and to do so some roughness is required on the surface area of the flange face the flange face finish is only for the raised face and flat face flanges common type of the face finish in flanges are as follows stock finish 
concentric serrated finish spiral serrated finish smooth finish and cold water finish based on pressure temperature rating the flanges are also classified by pressure temperature rating pressure temperature rating chart in the standard asmeb 16.5 specifies the non shock working gauge pressure to which the flange can be subjected to withstand to a particular temperature the pressure class or rating for flanges will be given in pounds so forged steel flanges pound rating are as follows 150 rating 300 rating 400 rating 600 rating 900 rating 1500 rating and 2500 rating whereas for forged cast iron flange pound ratings are 25 rating 125 rating 250 rating and 800 rating based on material of construction flanges are also classified on the basis of material of construction flanges are normally forged except in very few cases where they are fabricated from plates when they are used for fabricated they should possess weldable quality or they should have weldable properties the material of construction normally used are astm a105 for forged carbon steel astm a181 for forged carbon steel for general purpose astm a182 for forged alloy steel and stainless steel ASTM A350 or post alloy steel for low temperature services I hope you have understood the topic of this video as I have tried to give a brief introduction to flanges with its nomenclature and detailed classification of flanges This video is very helpful and important for freshers looking for a job interview This video is the introduction and classification of flanges for detailed classification of each flange I have shared the link in the description box below Thanks for watching this video if you like the content of my video please do not forget to hit the like button and share it with your friends and yes don't forget to hit the subscribe button and subscribe to my channel passionate piping engineer also press the bell icon below to get the latest notification of our upcoming videos till then stay tuned and take care